What's up guys? Today we are going to Nakuru for the Lake International Pan African Film Festival. I'm taking you on the journey. Watch this video to the very end. environment for our students in colleges and universities in Kenya. Using film, you can create awareness, this is anti, and um, also try and bring up ways in which we can like, tackle the issues that are affecting us. I see that through such streams, festivals, as in the more people, as in problems are there, so like if we know them, the better. So we film them, submit to any kind of festivals because apparently, you know, as an idea, your talent is also being exposed. The problems are, all, are also being exposed and people are getting aware of them. And uh, yeah. Can we show for economic empowerment? Let's check like this example. Through this competition, someone may win a cash prize. And through that, maybe in school you didn't have to have a sponsor and that will solve the problem of letting and sponsoring. And sponsoring or something like that. The second one, through feeling, so if someone can see the long term effect of their, of their actions and all that. They take the example of the lady who had to, who had to do, who had to take, who had to do this, who had to kill herself, who or committed suicide. If the guy had known that through whatever he did, that lady would have done, he would have done what he did. Now through that, we can solve, through projecting the long term effect of our actions, with through feelings, we can solve such problems. Wow. Yes, so through is in my field. If you can relate with them, when I'm doing a passport to what a kind of stars in our in our influence, do not even have influence positively and negative. So in a depend on the people here. My name is Mumo. I am a former banker <coughs> and an actual sales student, and I love film. I was a banker for seven years. And now I am a YouTuber, and this is what I love to do. Just coming and speaking about making videos on your phone and actually just inspiring the next group of creators. So that's the reason why I am here. They say with your mobile phone, you can create the best possible video. You can do it, on, you, you can shoot the mobile, the, the film on phone, Edit on your phone, publish on phone. You don't have to get the camera, do the shooting, transfer to your computers, then doing the editing. No. You can actually do it in the field, and even before you leave the site where you did the shooting, the video will be online. YouTube and Facebook are mostly vertical, not, not vertical, landscape platforms. So it means you love to shoot your video on landscape. If you're going to do it on Instagram or on Twitter, those are vertical platforms. You'll have to shoot your video on portrait. That's very important. And then we'll tell you that when you're using your mobile phone, whether the phone convinces you that it can zoom, do not zoom. Do not zoom. Okay. The first video is going to be your worst video. Okay? And that is true for everyone. Second video, you'll obviously do something better. Okay, so just sit down, plan something, shoot it. If you don't know how to edit, which I hope now you already know how to edit, edit it quickly and put it up. I attended this workshop on mobile editing by Mobile Journalism Africa, and it has, it's, really, it's really good. I've learned a lot. People have stories out there. Like, we have so many different ways of telling them and through that, through mobile, we are encouraged to tell them. We've also been taught on how to edit on mobile phones. 
and it's it's mobile as in it's mobile it's flexible you can go in you can go with it anywhere and get stories out there even without camera so yeah green lantern